Welcome. In front of me is a Google Pixel 5a and today I will show you how you can enable and also set up your portable hotspot. So to get started, we're going to pull down our notifications straight from the top. So I've done once more to extend the uh, list of toggles and on one of the pages, we should have a hotspot. Oh, it's for me right over here. So once you find yours, uh, you want to hold it first time around, this will quickly take you to the settings. Now, the reason you want to do this is because in the settings, you'll find out that uh, password by default will be just randomly generated. Uh, this one has already been set up uh, differently. So as you can see it, it's uh, very easy to crack, uh, but by default, you have like uh, random letters and the numbers. I recommend just completely removing it and placing your own password. Now your password does need to have at least eight characters in length. As you can see if I just remove one here, uh, so it's now only seven digits long, I cannot confirm it anymore. So make sure it's eight and you can confirm it. And that's really the only thing that I recommend changing. Uh, obviously you can change other things in here if you know what they are, what they are doing, but if you are not uh, you know, tech savvy, you don't know what these things are, I recommend keeping them as they are. This will ensure that your hotspot works uh, just perfectly whenever you need it with basically any device that you try to uh, use it with. If you change something, that might not, not be the case anymore. So anyway, from there, once you have changed the password, you can close this and let's find the toggle once more. Simply tap on it to turn it on and that's it. So right now, hotspot is running and you can connect to it with any kind of other device. Uh, one thing to also keep in mind when your hotspot is running, it's using your mobile network, not Wi-Fi. So that is an important thing to remember. And additionally, it also consumes more of your phone's battery. So once you're done using it, I do recommend trying to remember to turn it off. Otherwise, you might be draining your phone's battery a little bit too quickly for no reason. So to turn it off, find a toggle once more and just simply tap on it. As you can see, now it's off. So with this being said, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.